Hi you guys, welcome to the vlog. Um, we're at the mall right now and I am going to pick up a new bag today. It is spring it's very soon and I thought I would get the new color of the Uniqlo shoulder bag. So I'm thinking of getting either the blue or the white one. I think they're really nice colors and it's really nice. I already have the green one. I really like the green one. It's a nice versatile piece. It is very nice. I love how it slouches on your shoulders and it fits a lot of things. It can fit a chicken. <laughs> I saw on TikTok a girl put a whole Costco chicken inside that purse. So that's pretty crazy. <laughs> I think it's hilarious actually. And yeah, I I want to try putting a chicken in my purse, but that'd probably make it really stinky. So I'm not going to do that. <laughs> We're just at the mall. It's really early. It's like 920 right now and it is teacher's convention. So there's no school. So yeah, today's going to be a chill day. Not really sure what I'm going to do today. Maybe I'm going to look around HomeSense and just look at the outlet mall. So yeah, that's our plan today. We just got gas right now. I'm gonna get red swan pizza. I'm gonna get medium pepperoni, and it's gonna be a good lunch today. We're back home and we're gonna eat some pizza. This is the swan pizza, always fresh, always serving quality with the garlic, creamy garlic. And I got pepperoni pizza. Hooray! I'm so excited to eat this. Apparently, it was cheaper to get the medium than just get the individualized pizza that's for kids. They didn't have like an adult kids pizza type thing <laughs> so I just got a medium and it was only like $12 and then a dollar for the garlic uh, sauce so that's pretty good I think it's a really good deal but yeah uh, we usually go to Red Swan lately because it's so close to our house and it's just really good pizza I like the extra creamy sauce mm. it's so good the nice thing about this pizza is that it comes with sesame seeds. I really like that touch. It's really nice. Hi you guys, welcome back home. I just finished my pizza, I had my Pepsi, and I just wanted to show you guys what I got from Uniqlo from the mall. I wanted to show you guys the Uniqlo mini shoulder bag that I got. I wanted to show you guys the original one that I got previously. I think the one that I bought today is from the spring collection because they have a variety of different pastel colors. So I wanted to show you guys what I got. So this is the original one that I have. This is in the green color. It looks pretty much the same and it fits so many things in here. I, especially my wallet and my, my phone, especially, and my EpiPen. So this is a really good buy for $24.90. I really like the size of it. It's about a medium size and it just fits around the shoulder really nicely, just like a sling and you can adjust the strap as well. So that's what I really like about this. So now I'm gonna show you guys the one that I got from the store. This is the bag, I got a Uniqlo bag, 15 cents I think, and this is the mini bag. I think it's a little bit bigger than what I have. Yes, it's a little bit bigger actually. You can tell the difference. This one's a little bit smaller and this one is a, a lot rounder and more structured I think. This one's a little more slouchy and I don't know. The difference is very slight and slim, but I kind of like how this one's a little more together and stiff. Um, this color is a beautiful blue, light blue color. It's a pastel and I think it's really nice. 
Yeah, compared to this one, yeah, there's a little bit of a difference, but I kind of like how it's a little bit bigger. It could fit a lot more things, like the chicken. <laughs> and yeah, I really like it. There is a cell phone pocket in here, as well as like a, a little spot for your wallet. It didn't have that in the original one that I have, but I think that's a really nice addition to the purse. And I'm really happy with it. I think it's great. Maybe I'm just seeing things, but I think it's exactly the same size. It just looks a lot bigger because it's new and it's fresh and crisp and the other one's been used a ton of times. So maybe that's why I think it looks bigger, but I think it's the exact same size. and. I'm really happy with this size. I like the size and I think it's going to look a lot nicer with the things that I have for spring, my spring clothing pieces. So yes, I am very excited to use this. I'm in my bedroom right now and I wanted to show you guys what I got from Amazon. It is a hatch alarm dupe. It is called the Reacher. It's a sunrise alarm clock and I think it's a great dupe. It is beautiful. It is a nice, small, medium size. And I can't wait to show you guys what I have. So, I have this Reacher Alarm. It's kind of hard to see the color, but there you go. You can change the color. It's really hard to tell the colors, but there's a lot of variety. And it just looks so nice on my nightstand. It has a bunch of different sounds that you can sleep to and wake up to. And you can adjust the alarm. I think it's a great addition to my bedroom night routine and morning routine because it's just nice and small. It's cute. I love the colors. You can dim it. Oh, there's the color. That looks a lot nicer. So I'm going to show you guys the colors again. So these are all the different colors. I love the pinks and the peaches and the reds. The green is okay and the yellow is nice too. I like all of them. It, it's just beautiful. Um, I think I like this more than the hatch because the hatch doesn't look as nice as this. I, don't, I believe this looks nicer. And... I would rather look at this than the hatch. Um, you can dim the time, as you can see. See right here, you can dim it. Make it a lot lighter or darker. Yeah, I love this. This is so cool. It was only $40 on Amazon Canadian, and I really like it. I always put the thunderstorm sounds on. And I put the ocean as well sometimes. I really like it and I wake up to it. How you turn it off is you hold the little clock for a few seconds and then yeah, it turns off. So it's really perfect. Love it so much on my nightstand and you guys should go buy this instead of the hatch. So this is what it looks like on the nightstand. I think it looks pretty cool and the different colors it's just beautiful i love it so much so i wanted to tell you a really crazy story that happened to me on monday i was coming home from work i was scratching and itchy so much on my ankle and i was wondering why i was scratching so much so i ate dinner like my i normally did and then I took a shower and I put lotion on and then it just got severely worse. Um, my, I, there was bumps all over my, my arms and my legs. It was so bumpy. It was so scary. I've never had a rash or hives like that before. And I had no idea what was going on. I was scratching like crazy. All I did was put like baking soda on my body for a couple days. 
but it was still so itchy. So I decided to call the doctor, uh, get an appointment, and I went yesterday and they told me that it was a virus. It wasn't what I thought it would be, rubella, measles. It was a virus that I got from the school, I think. So yeah, I got these really crazy hives on my body and on my stomach my legs, my arms, my face even, and I wanted to show you guys what it looks like now. I um, got prescribed Blexton, which is an allergy medication, so I'm really happy that I have that. I can use it at night and it's a little bit drowsy, but I think it'll be good for me because it's pretty strong. So yeah, I'm going to show you guys what it looks like, and it's kind of gross. This is what my leg looks like now. It used to be a lot redder and more dotty than this. But as you can see, there's so many spots. And it's just all over my leg. Like, on um, this leg, it's kind of everywhere as well. And on my arms, I'm going to show you my arms. I have this bruise that I got. And... I got some scabs now because I've been scratching so instantaneously. <laughs> it was just so painful. Yeah, I thought it could have been like stress or even from the weather. I wasn't sure, but my doctor said it's a virus and I caught it from somewhere, maybe from school, and I've been itchy ever since. And I'm trying to find a good lotion. The doctor uh, said that CeraVe was good for my skin, like dry skin and whatnot. But I'm probably going to get it later because I still have some unscented lotions in my house that I can use. So I'm going to do that. And yeah, that's my update on my allergy. <laughs> I, I've been scratching so much and the Blexton will probably help. Um... I don't know how long this will last. It's been since Monday and it's Friday now. So I don't know what I'm going to do. We'll figure it out. She's going to call me tomorrow and tell me because I got blood work done. So she's going to tell me what's up. I thought I would go to the gym right now and do some 12, 3.30 for a little bit because my mom has been bugging me and telling me that I should go to the gym. So I'm going to go to the gym right now and work out. So I just put my hair up, put on an exercise shirt, and I got my sweatpants. As you can see here, I'm wearing my green sweatpants. I'm going to wear my New Balance uh, runners. So let's get going. This is my Nike Windbreaker. I love this so much. It's from Value Village. I got it for like $24, and it was a steal. I really love it. And here's my New Balance shoes. back from my workout I went to Value Village just because I wanted to look around and I found the cutest jewelry necklace holder it was only three dollars and it's really cool because it opens and closes and you can put put a lot of jewelry on here so I thought that would be really nice and then I went to Winners and I got the cutest mug coffee mug for drinking coffee I got this for Easter. It is so cute. It was only $5.99. Really cute. I love the little ribbed edges and it's really chunky and it's really cute. I thought this would go really well with my mug collection. So this is my new mug. I think this is the cutest mug that I own and I'm going to make some coffee now. waiting for my coffee I'm just gonna tell you about my workout I did 12 3 30 for a little bit and it was crazy because one of the machines wasn't working so it was like resetting and turning off and on and I didn't know what was going on so I had to switch treadmills 
for a second. And yeah, everything went well. Um, I was there for like half an hour and it's a really good workout. I love walking and it's just a really great way of exercising. So yeah, um, for my coffee, I use the Lactantia creamer, the half and half, and I use two Splendas and I'm gonna be using my, my little, what are these called, whisks? I don't know what they're called, but yeah, I'm gonna be using that. Um, I just use a little spoon for my half and half because if I put too much, then it's gonna taste really gross. And yeah, I'm just, I have a spoon, but I'm gonna use this instead. at the bottom and it said that this is dishwasher and microwave safe so I really like that and yeah let's try it the coffee mmm that's really good I really like this mug it is so cute it's really nice for Easter I thought it'd be nice for my mug collection and I think this one wins for sure just listened to Miley Cyrus's new song Doctor Work It Out with Pharrell and I love it so much. It's so catchy. She looks fire right now. <laughs>